the Nigeria National Petroleum Company hmm. Limited, yeah. NMPCF. What have they done again? Uh, it's less that Tinubu again increases petrol pump price to how much? Okay. Yes, this was observed on Tuesday at NMPC filling stations. Also, about three weeks ago, NMPC had fuel price to about 1,030 Naira per liter in Abuja and 998 Naira in Lagos. It was learned that this new increment we see Nigerians in Abuja and Lagos buy petrol for 1,060 Naira and 1,025 Naira per liter respectively. Previously, in other places where sold for over 1,250 Naira at NMPC stations, this increment comes barely one week after President Bola Tinubu boasted that this or his administration has provided Nigerians with a workable solution to the hike in the fuel price. According to the President, motorists can buy petrol at 1,000 Naira per liter or equivalent gas per standard cubic meter at 200 Naira. A press statement issued by Bayo Ononoga, special advisor to the President, Information and strategy last Tuesday stated that President Tinubu's belief is that investment in CNG will make Nigerians forget about the fuel price hikes. The statement said Tinubu thanked the Nigeria Independent Petroleum Company PLC for its prompt investments in the energy transition, saying the company's investment aligns with its administration's energy energy security and economic diversification strategy. The statement reads, he emphasized the importance of public-private partnerships in driving the transition to cleaner and more affordable energy solutions to, for Nigerians. The president lauded NIPCO's efforts in promoting and supporting the switch to CNG campaign, which has been instrumental in boosting public awareness and providing affordable CNG conversion kits even before the official kickoff of the presidential CNG initiative. The, he highlighted the significance of this initiative in reducing the nation's reliance on petrol and cutting down fuel costs for customers. CNG being a cleaner and more affordable fuel reduces the carbon footprint and saves consumers significant fuel costs. You see? Yeah, Tinubu said now that F4 is being sold for 1000 naira, which a lot of people disagreed with him that it is more than that. But what he was trying to say invariably is that if you cannot afford this, at least there's another one, there's an alternative, and that alternative is not there. And that is the propaganda that this man is just uh, putting up. So they can continue to increase the fuel price based on the fact that there is alternative, which that is not correct, according to Ogulo Jonathan. That is not correct. So we will continue to increase it and increase it and increase it and tell you that uh, it is you that want to buy fuel for that amount of money that you have alternative, you don't want to go for the alternative. That is where they are going. That is the kind of a leadership Tinubu is dishing out to the Nigerian people. Somebody clearly said, it is my turn without any other manifesto. We are so, were you expecting him to do anything differently? The good thing is those religious fanatics and the ethnocentric uh, chonivists are facing the same hits every other Nigerian okay, is facing. Nigeria will be better, but I don't even know when. The man has run out of ideas. He's only doing trial and error. Nigeria is on a roller coaster. Not trying to error. He knows what he's doing. Mm. He, has a, he has a target and he has an agenda. Let us see who will campaign for him in 2027. <laughs> if things continue like this, wow, don't don't just bother. Whether you campaign or you don't campaign. No. Okay, they've already made their preparations on how to get back if they want to get back. So all those talk eh, do not hold water. Well, do we still have sensible people stand on his mandate now? Suffering and smiling people 
we tell you his policy is for short term. Everlasting gain. Two years is going. No significant improvement. This is great news. Let us see the limited of Nigerians' tolerance. The best president of Nigeria. There is food security and roads. Employment and electricity. Everything is in place. By the time this man is done with Nigeria, some people will migrate to Cameroon and Benin Republic. Nigerians have the money as we can afford a phone of 100 and 200,000 or 300,000 naira food. If you can't even see all those 300,000 naira food that you are talking about as we speak. We the Yorubas have no choice but to kiss a hero. This is the best news that gives we the Yorubas joy. Our beloved brother or their son is giving us joy. When we told them to vote for Kwakwansu, they said was a local champion. Let's enjoy the benefits of international champion APC Wahala. <laughs> uh, so long, long. I will teach Peter will be a lesson. He never starts to Higbuma cannot rule Nigeria. Both Aosas and Yorubas will see the end. Keep it up, Mr. President. I always thank God who provides oxygen free of charge to inhale, which if it was in the hand of this tyrant, oh my goodness, <laughs> it would have been beyond our budget as just petrol uh, is just beyond our budget as we speak. Hope we will vote you again. Doing a good job, sir. You are doing a good job. I will never drink water and keep cup tea. What happened in Bangla Bangladesh happens in Nigeria. I don't even blame him. Blame the Mumus who kept silent watching Oju Yobo destroying them how bad and insensitive jeez just because uh, we are not even united to confront these bad leaders and that's what is giving them such a audacity and infantry to continue to do what they are doing don't be don't be surprised and don't forget they will come and tell you that uh, you know what if you can't go for that way the price of that way go for the alternative which of course they know that it is not true how many people most 99% of cars that we have in Nigeria are not a uh, CNG uh, built. So you want people to come and change to go and change their cars to CNG. And from what I learned, for you to convert your as at last week, you know that every day things get uh, uh, expensive. As at last week or so, when people said, "Oh, if you want to convert your uh, fuel car to CNG, you should be." Preparing for 1.2 million naira. How many people have that one? That kind of money. People will be saying they buy a movie. one square me a day. They won't produce a two, 1.2 million. Okay. We hear them. We hear them. So guys, let's say your opinion and have your take on this. Thank you.